Are you guys here to take them home? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Yeah, I'm all right. I'll get that ID out. All right. Yeah, I'll call you back. Yo. Yeah, I'll call you back. All right, man. Do you feel good enough to go home? No. No? Think you can walk out to the car? The main thing is supportive care and management at home is your main thing. Okay. So fluids, rest, it's all supportive care. There's not really too much here that we can mm -hmm. we can do that you can't you know follow up and do at home. Right. Okay? I blamed myself a long time for the failed campaign. I mean, this was the first time that it was a possibility that I wouldn't be able to help these kids do something epic. That was a tough pill to swallow. That was tough. That was tough. It's so crazy that the majority of We All Have Dreams, the story of Project Swag was shot on this camera right here. Well, it all started when a Buffalo man wanted to give people a wardrobe makeover. Uh, Sadiq grabbed a camera and he started to swag out the town. While swagging out people's closet, Ha Sadiq decided to take his project to the next level. Instead of making it all about a clothing makeover, he made it about life change. And he knows about life change all too well. This inner city basketball player has seen the inside of a prison cell, but says God made it his plan from the beginning. Here's his swag story. <laughs> so you might as well go ahead and put these on now. Okay. <laughs> I believe that life is about doing what you love every day and ultimately finding your life's purpose. <laughs> this is where we print the shirts. What that means to me Say happy birthday. is I love being a father and I love creating. The minute Lee gonna be in Target, y'all think I'm playing. <laughs> but I found myself on a path that in a million years, I would have never seen myself on. And I believe this path is my life's purpose. <laughs> Right behind Good Morning America, one of the producers, GMA Booking at ABC.com. Said maybe they can get, it, get me in there, maybe. We'll see. Uh, email them with the story today and see what happens. Shot nine, take one. So, what is the ultimate goal for Swag University? To do it our, you know, our way, to keep it real, but also to have it on one of the big three. Uh, you know, NBC, CBS, or ABC. The ultimate goal for the Swag New Clothing brand is to be in, you know, large retailers, Target. That was from my Shark Tank casting tape. Yup, I had big dreams of a young black man having his own TV show on ABC and my clothing in big box stores like Target, all centered around helping people and telling stories. That's how the dream starts, the initial excitement and I was shooting moonshots. We here at Jarrell House, we about to ambush him. He don't know what's going on. Got a bunch of swag for him, swag t-shirts, swag uh, hoodies, uh, some Converse, ATL hats. That's where we in, A-Town. Follow me. Yeah, just got a new friend. I'm your pal now, so call me anytime. Good luck with everything. It's the first right here. Julio's mother. Wow. You think you have any clue? He's a smart kid, he might, <laughs> but I really don't think so. <laughs> my name is Savannah. Me, my dad, and the person who is filming, which is my sister, uh, is doing this thing called Project Swag. Project Swag is a documentary uh, that we film, and we go across the country, and we meet kids that have disadvantages, and we help them have epic experiences. So we give them a platform to tell their story. From the story they tell us, we help them do something epic and have an epic experience. So each kid has an epic experience. Like, give me an example. When I um, realized that Tafik was going to have a lot of issues when he was a little baby, I was trying to think of a way to preserve him, the person. You know, so how, how do we preserve that? And I, I knew because um, he didn't have the physical gifts 
that most people are born with, that we were going to have to try to minimize his, um, his um, awareness of that so that he would feel optimistic and included, you know, and, and um, feel a part of the world in an equal way. So um, we, we always, you know, I always tried to talk to him a lot, you know, because words were important. That was something he could do, so he could talk. So I would talk to him a lot and read to him and play with him a lot. And um, I remember thinking when he was little, and I realized just how um, involved his, his disability was, I just remember praying that we would be able to talk to each other and play, that I'd be able to connect with him that way at least, you know, because uh, just to imagine how heartbreaking it would be to have to care for someone that couldn't, you couldn't really you uh, talk to him. about that video he said a lot of people in Boston saw that talk a little bit more about that uh yes um a couple websites posted it there's the bell it's the bell it's go time it's go time let's do it I got in the mood baby let's go let's go Since you didn't, your Patriots jersey was dirty, yeah. I asked somebody to bring you a new one. Okay. Tafit. Yeah? Heard you need a New Jersey. <laughs> Who was that? Brian. Bro! Heard <laughs> <laughs> your jersey was dirty, man. Dang. You got your new Patriots oh jersey. Oh, my God. <laughs> go, we'll put it on the back. <laughs> oh. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> You're the biggest Patriots fan out there. I I think I am. <laughs> I think you are too, man. How you like that surprise? I am shocked. <laughs> <laughs> Anything you want to say to him? It just it just gotta you gotta really take care of yourself on huh? the off season. <laughs> <laughs> I got you. I, I got you. Man. Oh, yeah. There you go. I got you. I will be. She says, he doesn't look good. And I said, I know he doesn't, you know. And she said, she said to me, she says, if this antibiotic doesn't work within a day or so, take him back to the doctor. And the school nurse called me because he was in the nurse's office again. And she said, Karen, she says, I don't think this is an allergy. She says, I think you need to take him and have some blood drawn. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and continue to follow this journey.